Today, we're diving into the life of Amy Roloff, the heart of little people, big world. Amy's been a household name for years, but it's not just her TV presence that's got people talking. It's her off-screen moves that are raising some serious questions. So, gear up. Cause we're about to unravel this mystery. Let's start with Amy's business, Amy Roloff's Little Kitchen. It's not just any cooking venture, it's a blend of passion and deliciousness, shared right on her social media. And who's usually there, enjoying those delectable dishes? Her hubby, Chris Merrick. But here's the catch. Amy's recent business paperwork is missing something, or should I say, someone? The plot twist? Amy's latest paperwork for her cooking business shows her name as Amy J. Roloff, not Amy Roloff Merrick. This bombshell was dropped by none other than the US Sun. Now, considering she tied the knot with Chris in 2021, post her divorce from Matt Roloff in 2016, this has got fans scratching their heads. Now, for those who are new to this drama, let me give you a quick tour. Amy and Chris's love story was a fairy tale for many fans. Remember, Amy went through a public divorce with Matt Roloff, her husband from 1987 to 2016. With her new marriage, everyone thought she turned a fresh page. But it seems like the story's got more chapters than we thought. In her other business, Amy Roloff Enterprises, she proudly uses Amy J. Roloff Merrick. So why the switcheroo with the cooking company? And here's where it gets even more intriguing. Chris, despite being a regular face in her videos, is nowhere on the company's member list. Fans are baffled, bombarding her with questions. Some are even calling her out for sticking to her previous surname. But the drama doesn't end there. Amy's move to exclude Chris gets more puzzling when you learn that she's working with her ex, Matt, on another business venture. Yes, you heard that right. Amy and Matt are teamed up for Our Pumpkin Products, Inc. This business, launched in 2016, is all about those seasonal goodies, with the Roloff Farms as its base. So here's the million dollar question. What's really cooking between Amy and Chris? Is this a simple oversight, a business strategy, or signs of something more complex in their relationship? And how does Matt fit into this entire scenario? It's a mix of business, personal life, and past relationships all rolled into one. I'm super curious to know what you think about this whole situation. Is Amy just being pragmatic? Or is there more to this story than meets the eye? Sound off in the comments below? I'm all ears. And hey, if you love diving deep into celebrity lives and unraveling TV show mysteries, make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel. We've got more amazing content coming your way. This is Max, your insider in the world of stars and stories, signing off. Stay curious, stay tuned, and keep being awesome.